Goedemorgen. Today I'm going to the Netherlands with Jorian. He's already up because he woke me up, then had a shower, and I stayed in bed. I fell asleep again, and then when he woke me up, he said, I'm already done, babe. Are you gonna get out of bed? I'm packing the last things and making myself a little breakfast, lunch, etc. Then I'm going back. Such a weird feeling after so long. But yeah, let me get to work, otherwise I'll miss my train because <laughs> I've been talking to you and I've been replying to comments for way too long. I am now quickly taking out all of the trash. It's not just mine, it's Jurian's and my roommate's as well, but I'm gonna quickly do that so that that's not left to like a rot <laughs> for the next four days. Good morning. Good hey, morning. Jurian got us even more snacks, snacks and snacks and snacks. We have so much food to take. Aww. Are you not allowed inside? Who has the key? Let me see. <laughs> I do. No. Are you ready for the Netherlands? I'm ready as I'll ever be. My suitcase is pretty light because I can leave most here in Berlin. So we're now going to the train and we're going to take our traditional last minute picture. Mr. Best Boyfriend is carrying his own bags, which are two, and then my suitcase as well. Thank you, Yurian. We're in the photo booth. Are you ready? Are you ready? <laughs> Ew! <laughs> okay, this time the pictures might have gone a little bit weird. But no worries. We'll show them all. We're not showing them all. <laughs> These are my favorite ones. <laughs> so excited for the pictures. Are they there yet? No, they're not there yet. You have to wait between two and five minutes. Hey, they're there. and misread the timetables so we were late for our train and we were running like crazy people we're still kind of like <sighs> but we just made it but that's because the train was delayed if the train wasn't delayed we wouldn't have made it thank god these are the german railways not the swiss railways <sighs> He bought me one of my favorite snacks. He just pulled it out of his bag. You're the double stuffed best boyfriend. And I want to show you guys our photo booth pics. Know what I mean when I say they got a little bit weird? I'm wisely using my train time to edit. You're into having coffee and cookies. It is six hours before we're in Amsterdam, and then we need to change the trains to go to The Hague. Jaren just told me that in this city, the Volkswagen cars are made. And this is where a bunch of cars are produced. Uh oh, snap. This just happened to my laptop, and Jaren is giving me some rescue duct tape. Because this isn't good. Seriously, guys, Jaren always saves the day. Very professionally done. I've been putting the Oreos in between, like, me and Jaren. And now they're super squishy and melted. They took a bite and then it all like poured up from the side. It looks kind of gross. We are in the Netherlands now and everything is looking so Dutch. Apart from this guy and German bears and even German Pringles. I mean, how Dutch do you want it? I'm starting to get more and more excited about going home because I'm realizing that I can show you all kinds of stuff in my city, like my favorite vegetarian and vegan snack bar, my supermarket, my house. Hi, I'm Leslie and I don't want to go home. The Netherlands is shit, but I like it. No, I love home, but I also hate it. It's like there's never a place like where you're from. It's always great to come home, but it's also boring quickly for me personally. Like, 
I love being in my hometown for like two days. I get totally relaxed, but after two days, I'm so bored. I just want to miss their birthday here. Really wanted me to come over. And I also really want to go over for, for you. It's his birthday tomorrow. And the day after, it's his party. He kind of guessed one of his presents. And I'm a little bit pissed off. But this guy is too smart. Apparently, the train is the best environment for me to edit. I almost finished editing three vlogs. Do you want your own YouTube channel? No. <laughs> it will be called How You're In and it will be about beer. Beer? Beer? Yes. They're out. We need more. We need new. We're in Amsterdam. Oh guys, look what I got this Instagram account tagged me in this picture and it's a drawing of me it's really adorable thank you so much I really like it it feels like a present I don't know I used to draw uh, it takes a lot of time to make something like that thank you I'm home and we got ourselves a treat we went to the vegetarische snack bar which is one of the few or maybe the only vegetarian and vegan cafeteria and their stuff is amazing. Yuri eats here very often. <laughs> I ate here regularly as well when I was still living here. Whoa, so much food. These are typical Dutch treats. They are called bitterballen. Pronounce that, bitterball. <laughs> They're normally made with cream and meat, but these are vegan, of course. So bitterballen, then kibbeling, I think that is either English or Dutch, I'm not sure. It's better than fried fish, but this is again vegan. And then a cheese souffle, which I think is also Dutch. Yep. Which is basically cheese that is battered and then deep fried, so the cheese inside is melted. And then these portions of fries are insane. I told Jurian not to get the, this many, but <laughs> he refused to listen. I think he was very hungry. Yep. So now we've got an insane portion of fries. Bon appétit! Good appétit! Oh, all this junk food. <laughs> so how is it to be back home? It's weird. I ran out of coconut oil in Berlin and it's the thing I use for my hair. So my hair has been kind of dry at the ends, as you can see. I think it's really, really <laughs> needs a mask. So I got myself a little bit of coconut oil and I think this looks so beautiful. Looks like a beehive. But then yeah, exactly. It looks like a beehive. So I'm gonna smother my hair in oil. This I'm gonna leave in for a couple of hours and hope my hair is happy after that. Do you want a coconut beard mask? No thanks. By the way, I left this much food and I hate wasting food, but I just couldn't do it anymore. What are you drinking? A non-alcoholic beer because I don't drink alcohol all the time. Seriously? Is that a non-alcoholic beer? Yes. Wow, I'm really surprised. It's only got like 5.2% alcohol. That's still alcoholic. That is not a non-alcoholic beer. Are you calling me alcoholic? I'm calling you slightly enthusiastic about beer. Beer's just got so many flavors. It's, it's awesome. I do trust Jiren as an alcoholic though, because I've seen him not drink for like a month, but miss the hair does like his beer. But at least I don't drink tea all the time. Tea drinking for life, man. Guys, I'm hiding. I'm wrapping Yurin's gift. He's not allowed to see. I wanted to take a shower and wash my hair with my Lush bar that's still new, that's in this house. I'm all excited. But then I remembered that the shower isn't working at the moment and there's only cold water. No! Save me, Yurin. I'm giving it my best job. It's half an hour before his birthday and poor Jurian is trying to fix the water. I really wanted to shine my shoes because they were looking so bad. This one's done. <laughs> this one obviously isn't. It looks so much better, doesn't it? Oh, oops, I think I've kind of been a shoe shining myself as well. And they're vegan leather. We couldn't make the warm water work. So now I'm gonna have myself an old fashioned middle ages washing cloth bath. You're in smell it. He doesn't like it. It's so good. It's lavender. I don't like lavender. It's 12 o'clock. It's Jerry's birthday. And he's unwrapping his present. You're 
You're just guessing everything before he opens it. What do you think this is? It's chocolate. My hair is getting combed, <laughs> but I was already doing my own hair. <laughs> Thanks, Yurian. <laughs> Everyone viewing will think you're abusing me if you start doing that. Sweeties, the birthday boy and me are going to bed. What do you want to do tomorrow for your birthday? Are we still going to make sushi? Yeah, we're going to make sushi. And I'm going to drink coffee. Do you want to tell them how old you are? 20. <laughs> sure. You're in turn 20. Right. <laughs> Guys, thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in tomorrow's one and then I'll show more of the house. I forgot and it's late now. Bye, see you in another 30 years. <laughs> Bye guys. Bye.